Marky Ramone left no stone unturned for his new book, Punk Rock Blitzkrieg, My Life as a Ramone, and it gives a rare and unique insight into what it was like being in the seminal band, the Ramones. Marky wasn't an original member, but he was the first replacement when drummer Tommy Ramone handed over the sticks. In the book released January 13th, he shares not only his musical journey, but also intimate details about his band members, all of whom unfortunately have passed. We asked Marky what stuck out in his mind about his bandmates after reading Punk Rock Blitzkrieg, My Life as a Ramon. He started with his best friend in the band, bassist Dee Dee. Dee Dee was, was bipolar. Uh, he exaggerated a lot, which probably helped him with his uh, songwriting. Very vivid, childlike imagination. And a great uh, entertainer, the way he would jump up and twirl and count off each song, which I never saw in my life when I first saw them. He then gave his take on singer Joey. Joey was a very quiet, introverted, you could say, uh, you know, flower child kind of hippie kind of guy, you know what I mean? Uh, which I have nothing against, you know. Uh, but he was the perfect histrionic singer. Marky also shared what he took away from guitarist Johnny Ramone. Johnny Ramone was your uh, bigot, uh, right-wing fanatic who I had things in common with, uh, collecting sci-fi posters, etc., from the 50s, originals. The fact that we liked uh, certain bands that we would talk about and things like that. But uh, he, was, uh, he was sent to military school as a, as a youth. And then I guess uh, that uh, ingrained in his brain uh, how to come off to people. You know, I mean, he's the only guy I knew that would fold his clothing and put it in a drawer in a hotel room. I mean, that's what they teach you, in, you know, in, in military school. I thought that was kind of weird. A anyway, he was, uh, he was like a drill sergeant, you know, but he didn't drill me, you know. The book may be one of the best in recent memory for rock biographies and a must for anyone sincerely into punk. He will celebrate with a New York City show with his band Blitzkrieg, fronted by Andrew W.K. on January 17th.